The Department of Chemistry in the Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology organized an international conference on the theme The Chemical Sciences, Chemical Ecology and the Economic Development of Ghana on the 28th November 2018 at the International Center for Innovative Learning. Dr. Nathaniel Owusubwedi, the chairman for the conference, gave his introduction speech. Uh, Research Institute UK, uh, leaders of the UK team and principal investigators of this particular research, Dr. Osafakwa, who is also the leader of the Ghanaian team and also the principal collaborator for this particular research. Dr. Mike Beckel from Rothamsted Research gave a presentation on developing smarter solutions. So, what I would like to say is a few words about um, Rothamsted. Um, um, as as uh, Dr. Mike said, it's now known as Rothamsted Research. Um, but, um, because of its longevity, the Institute has had several names over the years. Um, so for those of you who aren't aware, Rockstead is actually the oldest agricultural research station in the world. The, the, main, the main way of protecting crops and animals from pests um, for many decades now has involved uh, the use of pesticides, so insecticides, um, uh, the caricides, um, and these are, have been extremely effective, you know, so they, they are undoubtedly a way of controlling pests that you really want to be guaranteed that they are they, they kill uh, very effectively. Um, and the point that this slide, first slide shows is that a lot of them uh, have been um, created by development from natural products. A PhD student from the Chemistry Department of KNUST gave a presentation on investigating cowpea defense and pest management. By pest of cowpea and also to exploit um, the flower volatile that is being produced to kind of repel or attract the pest of interest. Uh, we have also been able to establish, although we are going to do a behavior studies, that Michael Retractor uses the flower boa down and search it for its host. And also once a bivy has been established, the plant is able to produce a bivy in its pitch. Of course, some are able um, to attract the two tested parasitic wasps. Dr. Joseph Vogt, a chemical ecologist from Rothamsted Research, gave a presentation on methods used in chemical ecology. ...to the behavior of the, of the insect that there is a role of uh, chemical cues that uh, interacts uh, between the people. For example, it's postman, like a crop um, So we watch virgin females and mating females have compared their juicy profiles. And again, the two male specific compounds that are marked with arrows appear on the mating females uh, extract. Tech TV News interacted with the coordinator of the conference. You know, for you know this uh, conference, uh, the, the conference, you know, we have you know tried to title it as an international conference on how the chemical sciences, chemical ecology, and other areas can impact on the economic development of uh, Ghana. And the head of chemistry department of KNUSC. Uh, I must say that I'm very happy today because of this conference on chemical ecology. We are going to have a lot of benefits from this collaboration. Apart from training our own students to become well equipped in uh, doing proper research into some of these areas, that is chemical ecology and uh, chemical sciences, we also would be able to help with national development from the outcome of the research that is currently going on. The researchers and some participants spoke with Tech TV.
And I think this conference is very important. But when I first heard the theme of the conference, which was uh, the role of the chemical sciences, chemical ecology in the development of Ghana, so I was wondering, I was trying to connect the doors, picture it, how this thing is going to, how will this thing affect the development of Ghana? So and then I decided to just come. So after coming for the conference, I realized that uh, it is a very, very important theme that needs uh, to be given the attention that it is being given. So when I came, I learned a lot of things. And then one of the things was that one of the presenters of this conference discussed how they have studied the chemistry and then how the insects are attracted to these what plants that is the cowpea and then how they have been trying to synthesize new compounds to mimic the way these pheromones that is the compounds that are found in the cowpea how they behave so that they can be able to come out with what new insecticides